Pesh scandal as Kisumu TNA party officials vouched to throw her out. So this is Senator. Uh, she's denying mm -hmm. sex in the car. <clears throat> Senator denies having sex with Nigerian. A Nigerian man. This is Nigerian Senator Gwendo, nominated yeah. Senator. Uh, nominated, she... This is the same Senator who got drunk some time back, eh? And this, the remember there was this also incident in Carnival, I think she was, she'd showed up with a man and... Those are stories still at the time. Mm. But people should just be allowed to do what they want, no? Yeah, but like no. <laughs> I, really I think they already are. Like we always get these stories about all these politicians on the news doing very untoward things. Like with, with, with politicians like those who need socialites. We've got <laughs> all the scandals, front page. What do you think it is about our society? Because in the Western countries, let's use the US for example, um, such scandals are so big it's such a huge deal it would get you to lose off look at the you know impeachment of, of clinton over that whole um lewinsky thing here it's just people will talk about it laugh gossip and then move on it's more accepted is it i, I don't know you know the um, I, it's, I don't even find that there's an issue with um, a private citizen um, engaging in whatever she's knowledge of anybody else. Citizen. But also, she's a, uh, not a private citizen. Yeah, she's a senator. Uh, but, you know, the headline is that she's denying um, that aspect. I, I remember uh, that story because uh, she herself had, it was already in a different daily, actually. And um, she put it on her page uh, that how could she be in two different places at the same time because on that day remember that flooding day where you had to turn and go to and go to mm. you know end up in a place which wasn't your home and um she also had to walk really a long distance and leave her car um in madaraka on that day there she um, meet the nigerian uh, no, no really i i, I do not know the allegations that were but she in her own words she actually explained um how she got stuck how her car and she was you know bare feet um bare i do feet. in the you know she had to walk she had to mm. leave her, her, her machine and actually just walk leave her heels because at that time really what are okay. you doing with heels you know when water is up to uh, god knows where uh, but back to you, Sophia. Mm. I do not think that um, that we are where the West is in terms of uh, sex scandals and and escorts. I think is it we, in terms of morality. Yeah, in terms of morality, I don't think that it's even an issue. I think we just make everything a laughing matter, and we read about it, and we just want to say, "Oh my God!" again, and we do not hold anybody accountable to it. Maybe in time, maybe in a few years, Vision Twenty Thirty, perhaps. We are loose <laughs> yeah. like Kenya gooses. Is, uh, very yeah. loose. Do you want to talk? Well, look, all necessary truth is its own evidence. So at least until, until we have the evidence that she's actually been doing this, then we can, you know, point her mm. to the wrong. Anyway, let's move on to something more interesting. I was still talking, Sophia. Okay. Because <laughs> you appear not to be <laughs> <laughs>